I don't have a tip for you. I'm so sorry. That's fine. Are you sure? Mm-hmm. Dude, look, if you can't tip, that's fine. Don't Thank you so much. Don't beat yourself up. Look, dude, I just delivered a pizza, all right? I didn't cut your hair. I didn't, I didn't clip your toes. Like, I, I didn't do any of this. I just came to deliver you a pizza, and, you know, anyone could have done that. And, you know, I get up, and... I work a nine to five because that's what I need to pay the bills. And, you know, I, I saw the job description. I saw the pay and I was okay with it. I said tips, you know, may vary. And, you know, you gotta take turns and that's why I work two jobs. And I, I don't want you to feel like you have to tip over something. I like to say something when it comes to tipping and it's tip when you can. You shouldn't have to always do it. And I feel like that's what people got lost in. People got lost in not knowing when to tip. I mean, if you go to your barber or nail technician or even your HVAC technician, I mean, all those people, they work hard, they went to school, they, they've done all these set of skills in order to maintain a job. And, you know, those set of skills, you should tip them. You know, but delivering a pizza and, you know, people are struggling and, that's what people forgot about. If you're struggling, other people are struggling too. And that's why we, we need to make sure to take care of each other and only tip when you can. So just double it and give it the next one. Before you leave, I want to thank you so much. You are one of the kindest people I've ever met. A breath of fresh air, a nice, nice man. Well, I just started like a month ago. So. Sorry, I have something for you. Here's five hundred dollars for being so nice and honest. No. God bless. You. Really? God bless. You. No. Yeah.